love and passion for food. Yes, it's mostly love and passion for chocolate, and that's how uh, everything actually started. I've always been baking. I, you know, my earliest memories of being in the kitchen is my aunt teaching me how to make brownies, and but I never really thought that it could be a profession. Um, I tried doing law for two weeks. I failed miserably. I didn't. Uh, I wasn't happy at all. It was. I knew. I. I just knew it wasn't for me. And um, the dream of the cafe and turning this baking into a profession kind of idea came when I was 17 and then I decided okay I should go to Switzerland and study hospitality. So Law 15 essentially Paris is divided into 20 different uh, arrondissements or neighborhoods and the 15th is where I lived. The idea was if you walked into any of our stores you would be transformed and feel like you were in Paris and it was like a piece of my home when I moved back. So I knew that because I only know dessert, so I knew when I had to do food I would need an expert and I would need someone that I could trust um, and I only knew that I had to call one person and uh, he said no several times before he finally agreed and said yes and came to Mumbai. Hi, my name is Pablo. I'm 27 years old, I've been in India for two months now. I'm, uh, I'm half Colombian, half Hungarian. I grew up in Colombia, in Bogota, in the capital. I came into this place the first time, it was like completely destroyed, there was nothing. I never thought it was going to become some, such a beautiful place like this. First day, I feel like it's been open for three years already. <laughs> uh, I can't even remember, it's just a lot of excitement I had to keep pinching myself I had to keep I kept looking at Pablo and I said I can't believe this is happening uh, you know we were having like a crazy day things were going wrong things were going but at the end of it I was just like I'm standing in my dream like it's uh, it's unreal everyone who comes here says like what should I have what is your favorite but they're all my babies and I've all I've made them all with a lot of love so it's really really hard to actually pick like I love the waffles, but I love the pork, but I love eggs, and I love the salads. Like, I made these beans and seed salad, which I've never thought about making like vegan or healthy food, like, as an objective. And I had it when I came here, because there's a lot of uh, vegetarian people, vegans or whatever, so I just wanted to adapt to, to everyone's taste, and just making a salad it was never one of my priorities in life. And right now I, join, I enjoy so much eating it. So, the whole menu is, has some story and has some particular things that actually uh, they're linked to my heart, to my feelings, so I cannot choose one dish. It's completely impossible. I just thought it would be really cute to name my desserts as women and then we were like, okay, let's get French women. and. Yeah, everyone thinks that's because of their, their Pablo's ex-girlfriends, but they're not. I think for me, because I'm a pastry chef and, you know, macaroons is what, you know, I, we're known for, what we specialize in. And often I have customers who've traveled all across the world and they'll come in and they'll try macaroons and be like, you know, now when I go to Paris, I can't even eat at La Durée or... And for me, that's like the biggest compliment someone can give me because that's, that's the company that I look up to and I aspire to and if someone can kind of put us on the same page, that to me is, is, is really uh, humbling. I'm so committed with my passion, like my work is what keeps me up every single day. Like for me, one of the most important things I have in life is family. And I left my family for this passion, like literally, like I'm, uh, I'm 18,000 kilometers away from home. I, I'm sad when I don't cook for people. Um, what drives me to work? I love it. I don't feel like I work. I feel like I don't know what to do when I'm not working. <laughs> I just instinctively am always working and uh, I just, I don't know, this is just what I love to do and I'm happy to do it. And there are days when it's difficult and I would rather just stay in bed. But um, on most days, I'm just happy to be here.